Lawmakers say reaching a deal on a bill to address the southern border is a top priority for this Congress. Senators say they're hopeful the deal will be bipartisan, but getting any deal through the House is already proving to be difficult. KCAU 9's Anna Warnicke is in our nation's capital with the latest. Speaking at the World Economic Forum in Davos, West Virginia Democrat Joe Manchin said if Congress wants to pass a border bill, they need to strike the perfect balance. You cannot have an immigration discussion unless you have border security. And unless you're committed to border security, we're not going to get that done. Manchin says the bipartisan bill North Carolina Republican Tom Tillis and Arizona Independent Kirsten Cinema proposed in December does just that. We are building the bipartisan coalition that we believe will allow us to pass legislation through both the House and the Senate this year. Cinema says she plans to reintroduce her bill when senators return later this month. But getting it through the new Republican House majority is already proving to be difficult. House Republicans say fixing the border starts with removing the man in charge of protecting it. Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas. We can investigate, and in that investigation could lead to an impeachment inquiry. House Speaker Kevin McCarthy says that investigation will ask how exactly Mayorkas is doing his job to address the migrant surge at the southern border. And if the answer is that this secretary is not doing his job, why would anybody want to keep him? But any investigation could take months. And New York City Mayor Eric Adams says border communities need the help now. We need comprehensive immigration reform. Congress must come together and partner with the White House. But we need an immediate response short term because it's impacting our cities. In Washington, I'm Anna Warnicke.